I was thinking of a story from the Bible. I'm not a religious man, but I've read bits and pieces over the years. Curiosity more than faith. But there's this one story. There was a man. He was traveling from Jerusalem to Jericho when he was set upon by men of ill intent. They stripped the traveler of his clothes. They beat him and they left him bleeding in the dead. Then a priest happened to pass by. He saw the traveler and he moved on that side of the road and he continued on. Then a Levite, a religious functionary, he came to the place, saw the dying traveler, but he moved to the other side of the road and passed him by. And then came a man from Samaria, a Samaritan, a good man. He saw the traveler bleeding on the road and he stopped to aid him without thinking of the circumstances or the difficulty it might bring him. The Samaritan tended to the traveler's wounds, applied oil and wine, and he carried him to an inn, gave him all the money he had for the owner to take care of the traveler. And as for the Samaritan, he continued on with his journey. He did this because the traveler was his neighbor and he loved his city and all the people in it. I always thought that I was a Samaritan in that story. It's funny, isn't it? How even the best of men can be deceived by the true nature. That means that I'm not the Samaritan in that story. That I am not the priest. I am not the Levite. That I am the man of ill intent who sat upon the traveler on the road that he shouldn't have been on.